What's up guys, it's King Josh back with another video, and today, this Fortnite gameplay that I have for you guys is the craziest game that I've ever played. So to start the game off, me and my squad decided to go to retail because we came here the past few games, and for some reason in Sniper Shootout, not a lot of people go to retail. But this time, I heard the garage getting broken down, I knew someone was trying to get in my building, I see a John Wick out here, I tried to snipe him, I missed, so I wanted to get a hunting rifle in this chest because snipers are not my strong point, so as you can see I did not get a hunting rifle, but I did get another bolt, and this guy's just chilling up here, I'm trying to target him, but you know, I'm not that good with snipers, so my shots weren't hitting, this guy is just running away from me I guess, I was just trying to throw impulses to get him away, he just hides there, and behind me out of nowhere, this T-Rex comes and gets me, and he tries to pickaxe me to death. So I'm running away from my life, I have 4 health, and I'm like screaming at my teammates to come help me. And then this John Wick is also over here, so I'm just hiding like a little baby while my teammates are fighting because I have 4 health, and in this mode, there's no getting down, like once you lose your health, you're done. So right now I go down to fight because I got teammates by my side, and I snipe them like that, so... Right there, as you can see, I just healed, I got some loot, and then I finally got the hunting rifle. And you wanna know what? My teammates are in another fight. So this guy right here that we were fighting, I don't know what he was trying to do. He's just jumping around like a maniac with a crossbow, switching a bolt and everything. And nobody could kill him, so we were just trying to pickaxe him. And we don't know what else to do, because our shots aren't falling. But look at this guy, he just decides to throw an impulse, and he goes flying. So he's like trying to fight us, but at the same time... He's kind of trying to run away, so it's a little weird. Like, right here, they were pickaxing him. So he's running away. He tries to trap us, but he ends up trapping himself. So we're pickaxing him even more, and then he's throwing more impulses. So we're just charging at him. It's a four-on-one. I missed that shot by a tiny bit there. He's trying to get up there, but I'm going to break his stairs. He's building a wall, blocking us out, building stairs and everything. Right here, he's going to get on top of the building, and I'm going to get an easy no-scope. So after that tough battle, me and my squad had to take a dance break. As you can see, Randy is in the dance circle doing that new disco fever dance. Me and Julian are just clapping for him, and Connor, as you can see, he's not so supportive. He's giving Randy the L, but honestly, I think that new dance is the W. I know you guys heard that sniper in the distance. So right here, we were all going paranoid because we didn't know where the people were. I'm just building slowly and trying to look for these people at the same time and right here I find a chest but I'm like getting a little shook because Randy's like oh they're 210 so I'm just building around me and I'm trying to get this chest at the same time hopefully I can double blue hunting rifle but it is only gonna give me a green one so I leave that there but I do find a shield down here so I can get to full health I'm gonna heal up and we're gonna go attack these people okay so at this point I was all healed up and my teammates put down a launch pad, and the people were like behind us, they were gonna get cut off by the storm, so I decided to just launch pad over here, look for some people by the trucks, in the grass, and at this point, I didn't see anyone, my teammates were coming over to me, and that glider right there, that dragon glider that Randy has, that thing scared me, because at first, I didn't even see his name, I just saw somebody on a glider, and then a bunch of sparks, and right here we see an airdrop, but we do see some people around 60, Right there, I tried to get one of those crazy snipes. I thought he would like move to the right instead of going straight down. So that could have been an easy snipe, but I just predicted it wrong. But it's not that big of a deal. There are 19 people left. Uh, Randy's going to get this airdrop right here. I'm going there just to guard him. And right now, we're feeling pretty good about this game. Connor's got low health, so we got to help him heal. But other than that, we're in a good situation. As you can see, Julian just sniped someone. And I'm looking for these other two people that were just on their gliders. And I think we lost them because I have no idea where any of these guys went. So 30 seconds after this, we're all just chilling. And then Julian sees someone in this little thing he had, Dusty. And we're just all going in. We're going to rush him. But look at this. He's building. And he doesn't know what he's doing. He's just impulsing himself. He goes flying. Everyone's just shooting at him. And look, he's just throwing impulses. He's going to throw himself into the storm. Like right there you can see he goes into the storm. He's going to run out and then he's going to impulse himself back into the storm. So we're all looking for him. And he's right there. I miss. I miss again. This is really bad. I'm trying to like build them in and trap them. So that way Randy and Julian can build even more. Put some traps around this guy. Do stuff like that. So as you can see they're trapping him. They're in the little square box. And they're putting traps down. But this guy is not dying. That took a while but he finally did die. They're going to get all the loot. And there are 13 people left, we got our full squad, so we're still feeling pretty good about this game. 
So right here, I'm way in the back. I'm not really involved in any of the action, but look into the base right here. Randy's in someone's base and he impulses them out and they die. They just launch pad it in and then this guy just flies out of the base from the impulse. So right now it's a four on four. We're still feeling pretty good about this, but we can hear snipers everywhere. And look at this guy. He's going after Julian. I'm telling Julian there's a guy after him and he gets him in one shot. So now I'm kind of shook that this guy's going to get me. It's a four on three now. And this guy seems pretty good because he hit Julian with the first shot. So right here, Randy's rushing this guy. I'm kind of staying back because I'm not that good with a sniper. So if I go right in front of him, I'll get hit point blank and I'm going to die. But right here, I decided to go help Randy. And look at that. I see a sniper bullet fly right past my head from the west. I'm assuming it's that guy's teammates, but honestly, we never found out because everyone dies. So you have no idea who's on whose team. So this guy, I have no idea where he went. Like he just ran in this direction and I guess he just disappeared. So right here, me, Randy, and Connor decided to rush Tomato Town. That guy that we were chasing before finally died. So it was a three on three and we knew someone was in here. We heard him. I go upstairs and he's right there. I tried to double hunting rifle him. That didn't work. My aim is pretty bad. And then this guy is right in my face. I get really scared. I'm trying to like build him out or something just so he can't get to me and so I can actually reload. So I'm trapped in here, and I was about to build a window, but then Randy just builds a door, and we go in there, we corner him, and he dies. So it's a three on two. Things are looking even better for us. I only have two kills, but hey, I'll take it. I'm not that good with snipers, so two kills with snipers and hunting rifles is pretty good. And look at this. I have 24 traps. So I thought it would end, like, actually in the building. So I decided to use all my traps, and looking back at this, that was, that was a bad idea because... Later in the video, you'll see that I might need traps for something else. So I just used like half my traps. So right here, this game is a two on two. We see this guy in the base. He jumped out. We're trying to shoot him. And once again, my aim is not the best. So we're trying to shoot him. We're not hitting him. And Connor died, sadly. It could have been a three on two, but he unfortunately died. And right here, this is where things got out of hand. We were just building up, trying to get the high ground, looking for these people. I had a feeling they were behind me, trying to run up the stairs, flank from the back. So me and Randy just jumped on the airdrop, and there's a guy right in front of us. We're just shooting like crazy, shooting like crazy. The storm's coming in. Randy's trying to impulse him into the storm and everything, but nothing is working right here. Randy's just in a 1v1 battle with him. This guy goes flying into the storm. I lost him for a second, and he's trying to shoot at me, so I get really scared. I kind of like run back. I'm just, I don't know. I didn't know what to do at this moment. But Randy's running away from this guy. I see him around the corner. Look at Randy's health. He's got like 10 health, something like that. And Randy opens the airdrop. This guy is like rushing but hiding. I don't know what this guy's strategy is. So I'm just running away trying to get high ground on him again. And look at that. He kills Randy. So it's a 1v1v1. At this point, I was so shook because I thought it was a 2v1. I thought I was done. I just kept trying to shoot this guy. Build while I reload. And right here... I put myself in. I don't know why I did this. Looking back at this, it was a bad idea. I've used all my traps. I don't know why I put traps on the ceiling. And this guy's trying to break into my base now. So now I'm going crazy again. I'm going so crazy that I just shot the wall out. So I was trying to get this guy to come through the top and then maybe trap him. I built stairs there because I don't know what his game plan is. I'm in the circle. I kind of wanted to build a door and get out, but at the same time, I was scared that he would be right there waiting for me and hit me point blank. So right here, I hear noises everywhere. I don't see where he is. So I'm just chilling down here, looking around. I still don't see anything, but I hear building. And then I look up and he's trying to get the high ground on me. So at this point, I was going even crazier. And I hear shooting. So then at that point, I found out it was a 1v1v1 because this guy was trying to break down my base. But at the same time, it sounded like he was trying to fight someone else. So I'm still chilling in here, and at this point, I thought it was time to escape. It was my chance to escape because this guy was fighting another guy, I thought. Because I heard no more movement because he wasn't trying to get me anymore. He was focused on someone else. And then my teammates were like, get out, get out. But I was, I was still kind of shook. So right here, I finally listened to them, decided to get out, and I'm rushing this guy's base. And then here's where things got crazy. So he's just building up this platform. I get up. I'm looking for him. I don't know where he is. And I'm just on this platform, just chilling. 
I still don't see anyone, but I'm hearing things. I'm looking at my old base, I don't see anyone. And then this guy pulls up behind me out of nowhere. So I gotta reload, build, fight, all this stuff at the same time. And this guy almost hit me there. So I'm just trying to build, he's trying to build. I'm building a ceiling so he can't jump down to me. And then he's right in my face and I no scoped him. So now it's a 1v1 and here's where things get crazy. So that's gonna be it for me. I'm gonna let you guys watch the last three minutes of this video. This is the craziest battle I've ever done. I'm just gonna put music over this because if I post commentate over it, it's gonna be me saying the same stuff pretty much. So just watch the last three minutes of this. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'm out. Peace. Top four when I top back in the five. So alive, I could die right now. Come back, still alive. You was fake with the handshake. Now you come back, still a fives. On the one umbrella, my left about a grandmama crib. Then I went back to the ways. Went back to the field. Had to hit a step back for the plays. Step